blog post page is a fantastic way to connect with your customers, boost your SEO, and drive more traffic to your store. Let's get started to design stunning blog pages with PageFly. First, we will begin by creating a Shopify blog post page using PageFly. There are two methods for creating a PageFly blog post page, starting from a blank page or utilizing pre-designed templates. Choose the page type as blog post. Select the option that best suits your preferences to get started. Let's proceed to the next step. Edit blog post page settings to navigate to the page settings. Scroll down to the theme section, enable blog post info. You have the option to enable the display of tags, images, or comment forms, but there is no need to worry about it. If you wish to showcase this information, PageFly already includes these elements. You can choose to enable lazy load images for any page you want. The lazy load images option helps to optimize your page loading speed. If you wish to display the blog post on your PageFly pages, you can utilize the blog post component or simply search for them. To create a captivating page, let's incorporate the blog post details element. Navigate to the add element icon, choose Shopify, scroll down to the blog post details element, then drag and drop it into the page editor. To view the blog post element, you need to publish the page for the first time. In the blog post source section, you can select auto, which will automatically assign the page to any blog post created in Shopify, or custom blog post allowing you to choose the specific blog post you want. To edit the selected blog post in Shopify, simply click on this button. Set the column per line to one and change the image height. Then adjust some styling in the Styling tab. To create a space for readers to engage with the blog, you can use the blog post comment element. Here, I've added the blog post comment element onto the page canvas. However, it appears that this element is currently disabled by Shopify. To rectify this issue, simply click on the button. Within the comments section, click on blog post to enable comments. Opt for the third option, which allows comments to be automatically published. Finally, click on the save button. Great, the blog post comment is available. I will take a moment to personalize its appearance Here we are. Now I will guide you how to add blog post tags in PageFly. Firstly, add the blog post tags element into the page editor. Choose custom blog post and there you can select the blog post that you want to show tag. Remember that this feature will only work if the selected blog post has tags associated with it. Finally, add blog post page to Shopify menu navigation. Head over to online store, choose navigation, then navigate to the main menu. Click add menu item. Put the name as blog post. This is the blog post you wanna add in the menu navigation. Simply copy the URL and paste it here. Then click add and save the work. Now let's take a look at the storefront. And there you have it. This is the end of the video tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe us on YouTube channel to get more new videos. Our friendly and knowledgeable team is available via live chat 24 seven. Thanks for watching.